Hello again to Leukemia Corner with Taylor, which could be a pretty good name for my series. Um, <clears throat> been a good day. Uh, got some chocolate milk right here. Um, haven't thrown up in a while. Haven't eaten in a while until today when I was force fed honey on toast by mum. Um, but that was the first thing I've eaten in about three days, four days. So that's good. Um, had some lasagna as well this afternoon. So that was nice. Had a visit from a lady from Click Sergeant, which is a um, charity based up in Southampton Hospital for zero to 25 year olds with cancer <clears throat> so um, yeah she was really nice we talked about um, just sort of things I'm entitled to like free money and uh, concert tickets and Facebook groups that I can now be invited to because I have the secret access code of having cancer um, <clears throat> so that was nice um, it's good to know that all these cancer charities and things that people donate money to are indeed giving it back to people with cancer um, so that was good that was good news um, so I said I had lasagna had, I actually ate some of the hospital food today which I hadn't done for a while, the whole beige and brown tray is a bit off-putting um, but I forced myself to eat some of the chicken uh, had some like cold chicken breast this afternoon and then just now I've had some uh, bit like southern fried chicken but a little overcooked with some soggy potato wedges and a little square of ham and cheese toasty um, with really plastic nasty cheese so I didn't touch that again had a Bakewell slice, which is probably one of the first sweet things I've had in a while as well. Two Bakewell slices. Um, and chocolate milk now. So, <coughs> Mother says that if I have had enough, then I will be allowed some of Marcelo's goulash, which is like a Hungarian stew, for those that don't know. And I have been really craving goulash, so I am doing what I can to earn it. In fact, the food cravings have come back now, just my appetite hasn't. So I'm stuck in this very awkward rut between really wanting stuff like fajitas and KFC and Thai green curry, chicken tikka masala with poppadoms, mac and cheese, like slow cooked ribs. But I just don't have the appetite to even like smell these things. Like if you brought it all to me, I probably would throw up just from overexposure to everything. Because my taste buds are all messed up. I had a smoothie yesterday. I like requested a fruit smoothie from home. So mum and dad, you know, as lovely as they are, made a fruit smoothie for me. Um, brought it in. And uh, I was like, yeah, this tastes like popcorn and dirt. Which, by all accounts, was wrong. Apparently, it was very nice. But um, my taste buds are all up in the air, so I was not able to enjoy that, unfortunately. Very sad. But I'm happy to announce that chocolate milk is still the same as it was. Uh, probably worth mentioning in the last video, I made a little quip at the end about sending less cards and more chocolate. I would like to retract that statement and say it was more of a joke because I already have plenty of chocolate and I do not crave more in fact I crave hot savoury things for now so I probably appreciate a I don't know a bowl of seasoned chicken maybe some Nando's garlic bread over a dairy milk bar but any chocolate that has been sent, Dad will appreciate massively. Um, 
What else do I need to mention? Playlets. I've got some more platelets up here, just out of out of the camera. Um, I have been uh, unhooked from this for most of the day now and yesterday, um, so that's good. I've just been walking around, and I've also been taken off the fluid chart, which was what they were taking note of all like my fluid intakes and outtakes, if that is correct. So. All the water and fluids I was drinking was being taken note of, and then I also had to pee in like cardboard pots in the bathroom so they could take it away and take a good look at how much pee I had, um, so just to make sure none of it was like building up inside me. Um, but I've been taken off that now, so I can pee in the toilet like a big boy, which is nice. It's nice to feel like a man again. Um, Weight has dropped a bit since arriving. That tends to happen when you don't eat. The doctor himself actually said he could notice my muscle mass has decreased. I told him to do one. I'm massive as ever. Um. <laughs> um. Platelets. Yeah, it's got my platelets there. Hulk, Hulk there. <laughs> um, so anyway, <clears throat> that'll that'll do it for today's update. Um, had a little uh, visit from from my good pal Luke today, um, but I would say that is all. Plan for tomorrow. Um, might take this dressing off tomorrow, maybe, maybe tonight, but I think that is all. So thank you very much, catch you in the next one, uh, see you then.